Hi family, I'm getting ready to bed, go to bed and I wanted to share this Amazon find with you. I was looking at a blogger on YouTube. Um, oh, I can't think of her real name, but her blog channel is JA Blogs. And she was sharing this lotion and was talking about how good it smelled. So I ordered some, I actually ordered two bottles. I ordered this one and another one. I'll show it to you in a minute. But I wanted to say, first of all, here's my disclaimer, right? I did not pay attention to what the name of the lotion meant or the picture on the front. I was listening to what she was saying about how good it smells. And when I ordered it and it came, yeah, that's some cannabis on the front. The name of it is Hemp's. And I didn't think about hemp seed and cannabis. I didn't think about it, so I'm not promoting that. But when I tell you that this lotion, not only in the three days that I've had it, my skin is noticeably softer, the smell is ridiculous. This is the fresh coconut and watermelon. It might be backwards on the screen, but this is the fresh coconut and, water, and watermelon. This is the one that I first started using. But honestly, this one smells even better. This is sweet pineapple and honey melon, and they have other um, scents as well, but this lotion is the bomb. Sweet pineapple and honey melon, fresh coconut and watermelon, and I'm not promoting anything other than this lotion is very moisturizing and it smells really good. So if you're looking for a good lotion, if you're interested, of course, this isn't illegal. I don't care for the picture of the leaves on the front, but the lotion smells ridiculous. I'll leave the link to both lotions down in the description box below. So that is my Amazon find for the week. All right, talk to you later. Good morning, it's the Mobile Home Diva. Just got up, getting ready to go to work. And I thought I would share my early morning routine. You know what, I'm gonna start doing right by my candles. I'll be right back. I got the set specifically for um, my candles and I never use it. It sits on the coffee table with, um, the candle that's there, but I wanted to share with, with you. It's a three piece set and it's specifically for your candles. These are scissors to clip the wick ends. And then you know how the, the wick part goes down in the candle and the candle gets hard. This is like, uh, where you can lift it out. And this is the snuffer. So when you want to put the candle out, you put this over the fire and it puts the candle out. So what you should do, I have this candle that I started burning yesterday. It came from Walmart. It's called Breathe. It smells amazing. If you remember um, it, uh, my bath and, maybe it wasn't my bath and body haul, but a haul that I did that day. Um, where I got one candle from Walmart for $3.33. Well, that candle burnt so well and it smelled so good that I went and got another. So I went and got them. This was the original candle that I got. It's um, Papaya Passion by Mainstay, which is the Walmart brand. Smells so good. So I got this one originally just to try it and it smells so good and it lit my house up with fragrance so well that when I went back last night, I said I was gonna get another one. So I got the Papaya Passion. I got the Sweet Apple, smells really good. And I got Breathe. And I lit this one in the bathroom last night because it went with the colors of my bathroom. <laughs> that was the main reason, but it burnt so well. So. If you look at the wick, you see how when it goes out, it gets those balls on the end. When you light these, they flicker 
fire pops and all of that. So all you have to do is go in with your wick cutter and just clip those off. That's all you have to do. So you get rid of those. And then when you light them, you have a smooth burn. And you don't have to worry about it. See, it's not popping and, and fire popping everywhere and all of that. So it gives you a smooth burn. So it's really good. This set um, is comes in different colors. I have the rose gold. They have the regular gold. And I believe the brush nickel and the silver. <clears throat> if you like stuff like that, if you're interested in and checking it out i'll put the link to it down in my description box i got it from amazon so i'm just gonna get myself together really quickly um before i have to go to work yeah i'm gonna have to clock in at 7 a.m so we need to get ourselves together so i'm gonna use my satin lips this morning my lips feel really dry they're getting better I think I'm having a reaction from this toothpaste I'm using, but it's doing so good. My teeth are getting whiter that I'm going to keep using it. Unless my lips swell up like this, I'm going to keep using it and see what it does. But I'm going to use my Satin Lips by Mary Kay. It's a two-part process. So the first part of the process is the scrub. It's a sugar scrub, Shea's sugar scrub. And you just need a little bit on your finger. So you rub it in. And you can feel it working. It's like an exfoliant getting that dead skin off of your lips. Let me get a washcloth. Next thing I do is brush my teeth. I'm using the Arm & Hammer Advanced White Toothpaste. I'm actually using two types of toothpastes. Two different toothpastes. In my whitening process, the first one is the Advanced White. This is to clean my teeth. So I went and got them. This was the original candle that I got. It's um, Papaya Passion by Mainstay, which is the Walmart brand. Smells so good. So I got this one originally just to try it. And it smells so good and it lit my house up with fragrance so well that when I went back last night, I said I was gonna get another one. So I got the Papaya Passion. I got the sweet apple, smells really good. And I got breathe. And I lit this one in the bathroom last night because it went with the colors of my bathroom. <laughs> that was the main reason, but it burnt so well. So if you look at the wick, you see how when it goes out, it gets those balls on the end. When you light these, they flicker fire pops and all of that. So all you have to do is go in with your wick cutter and just clip those off. That's all you have to do. So you get rid of those. And then when you light them, you have a smooth burn. And you don't have to worry about it See, it's not popping and, and fire popping everywhere and all of that. So it gives you a smooth burn. So it's really good. This set um, is comes in different colors. I have the rose gold. They have the regular gold. And I believe the brush nickel and the silver. Like that, if you're interested in, in checking it out, I'll put the link to it down in my description box. I got it from Amazon. So I'm just going to get 
my stuff together really quickly um, before I have to go to work. Yeah, I'm gonna have to clock in at 7 a.m. So we need to get ourselves together. So I'm gonna use my satin lips this morning. My lips feel really dry. They're getting better. I think I'm having a reaction from this toothpaste I'm using, but it's doing so good. My teeth are getting whiter that I'm going to keep using it. Unless my lips swell up like this, I'm going to keep using it and see what it does. But I'm going to use my Satin Lips by Mary Kay. It's a two-part process. So the first part of the process is the scrub. It's a sugar scrub, Shea Sugar Scrub. And you just need a little bit on your finger. So you rub it in. And you can feel it working. It's like an exfoliant getting that dead skin off of your lips. Let me get a washcloth. I'm gonna let that water warm up for a second. Next thing I do is brush my teeth. I'm using the Arm & Hammer Advanced White Toothpaste. I don't want to fall for you, oh no But you make it so hard Good morning, family Happy Wednesday So, let me tell you what happened Yesterday morning, I made this video The same video and did a whole routine and it wasn't recording. So I got up to me brushing my teeth. So I said that I would finish the video this morning. So that's why I got on a different outfit. I'm relighting my camera because that's what I do every morning. I'm cutting my wick because I'm trying to make a practice of doing right by my candles and I'm going to go ahead and brush my teeth and do all the stuff that I've already done on my video already I don't want to fall for you oh no but you make it so hard Watching you dance so night, baby. Okay, so after I brush with Advanced White, Arm and Hammer Advanced White, still looks yellow. Then I go in with 3D Crest White Mint, and I use the kind called Radiant Mint. I'm gonna end up. I mean, I see a difference in my teeth. But I'm going to end up um, going to get my teeth whitened. I don't want to fall for you, oh no. But you make it so hard. Watching you dance all night, baby. It's making me fall hard. Trying to take a deep breath, but I just can't control my I'm starting to see a difference in my teeth, um, a slight difference, but I'm not going to be satisfied until I um, go get them whitened. So I'm going to make an appointment to do that as soon as possible. Um, so the next thing I do is I just took some water on my hand and just wet my with my face. I I'm using the Tula Probiotic Skin Care. This is the Purifying Face Cleanser. A little bit of do. That's all I use.
And then just rub it into your face in circular motions. I'm waiting on my, I like this. This came in my Fat Fit Fab Fit Fun Box, the trial kit. Oh, and by the way, I did order um the spring box after receiving the trial kit because I liked all the products in it. I think it's great that they give you a trial. So before you even order, you can take advantage of the trial and just see the quality of the products that um that you receive. So I ordered the spring box. It was $49.99. And they have quarterly boxes. So spring, summer, winter, and fall. I ordered the spring box. And it should be coming soon. So when it comes, I'll do an unboxing so you can see the difference in what you get in the trial box and what you get in the big box. I make my washcloth as hot as I can stand it. And I just lightly touch my face to get the product out. When I tell you that between the purifying face cleanser and the firm and sleep mask that I got in my Fab Fit Fun box. And I mix it with this zero gravity whip day cream that I got from Nurture by Nature, which is another subscription company. My face, I noticed throughout the day just how smooth my face, how soft my face feels. Now I'm waiting on my Mary Kay. Um, miracle set. I did order that. The miracle set and I ordered the charcoal mask. Um, I had some samples, two samples that came with the other items that I got. And I love the way the charcoal mask makes my face feel. It really feels clean when I take it off and my face feels really firm. I'm excited. There's a whole set it's a four-piece set that comes in the Mary Kay Miracle set, but I'm really excited for the under eye cream because it's supposed to tighten that up. So we're going to see. We'll try it for 30 days and see. What I'm going to use now is the Firmin' Sleep Mask. Just a little bit of do. And I know I'm not going to sleep, but I use it throughout the day. So just a little bit of do. And then I take a little of the day cream and I mix them together. And I always rub things in my face in a circular motion. Well, not always, ever since my Mary Kay friend showed me how to do it. I try to rub it in in a circular motion, firming up my skin. So then the only thing left to do is finish off my lip routine. And I, I, I use the scrub, the Shea Sugar Scrub by Satin Lips, which is Mary Kay. And now I'm going to use the Shea Butter Balm. Um, it's about the consistency of Vaseline. Can you see it coming out? And that's all you need. Just a little bit of do it. And that's it. Now I know most people get ready to, for work, got to do their makeup. Got to put clothes on and all that. But I work from home, guys. This is it. We ready to go to work. I grabbed a bunch of these. Not a whole lot. But I grabbed a few of these. You can get them when you're like in at McDonald's or somewhere getting coffee. And I brought them home because I figured another way to help my teeth is to drink my coffee through a straw. Ooh, that's hot. So I normally let it cool down a little bit, but I try to put the straw back as far as I can and use the straw to drink my coffee. I don't know, what, what are your hacks on 
keeping your teeth clean when you're a coffee drinker? Y'all comment below and let me know what to do. I'm not sure if this works or not. And as you can see, if the coffee's really hot, you have to be careful. But um, I've got to do something, you guys. I know, number one, I need to go and get my teeth clean. They haven't been clean in a while. And get them, a matter of fact, I haven't got them clean since last year. I missed my six-month um, cleaning because we moved here. And now another six months has passed. Oh, by the way, I'm going to be doing a six-month review um, soon. February was actually six months. But February, we had um, some stuff going on. It was a short month. So in this month, I'll be doing a six-month review of the house. But um, let me know your thoughts on how to get my teeth clean. I'm using the Arm & Hammer Advanced Wipe Toothpaste with baking soda. I'm using um, the 3D Crest. Do I need to get the whitening strips and do that for, what, a week, two weeks, however long it does? Should I just go get them um, whitened? Now, in this light, they look a little lighter than they do in the bathroom. I think I don't have a daylight light bulb in there. I think it's just a regular light bulb. And I need to get some more and make sure that all the rooms have the daylight light bulbs. But um, what are your hacks? What do you do? So let me know in the comment box, comment section below, okay? Thank you guys so much for watching, for tuning in to this video. I know it was just a get ready with me, but I love to take you guys on whatever I do. Now I need to go to work. Talk to you soon.